Welcome to Beer and Board Games, folks, and be prepared for a lot of snapping and biting because we're about to play Untamed Feral Factions. <laughs> No biting. <laughs> no more biting. <laughs> <laughs> Untamed Feral Factions is a card game. The object is to attack your opponent's strongholds with your special animals. And right now I want to attack a beer. Tonight we'll be attacking from the One Barrel Brewing Company. Forward, Cherry Colch. That's not too sweet. But the cherry is very good. It's a bit too tart and tangy for my tastes, but I don't mind it. I don't mind it. You can use that slogan, One Barrel. <laughs> oh, no, that's nice. Sometimes cherry stuff is really thick and cloyy. Like, it's uh, like, like that, that cherry beer we had that one time. I forget what it's called. It came in a big bottle. Oh, yeah. Oh. Was that Lambic or something? Yeah, Lambic. Yeah, Lambic. I don't like Lambic. This episode was sponsored by the makers of Untamed Feral Factions. So how do we play the game? First of all, you have to decide what factions you want. Two teams. <clears throat> boink and boink and dink and dink. Dink and dink. There's six different animal factions for you to choose from. You got foxes, pandas, snakes. You got bunnies. Uh, what is that? Turtle? Lizard or turtle? And rhinos. The objective of the game is to destroy your opponent's strongholds, of which they will have four. Will they know my arse strongholds? Will they know your arse? Will they know my whole of strong? By the end of this game, they will know <laughs> Sheila's arse. We know that already. I know it well. Too well. We've known Sheila since the 90s. <laughs> and her arse. I think my ass is better now than it's ever been, though. Really? Yeah. Fractions, stronghold. Yeah, so anyway, you're proud of your ass. That's great. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not necessarily saying I'm proud of it. I'm just saying it's better than it's ever been. Yeah, okay. okay, how do we choose animal factions? By They're sound effects. <laughs> okay, you make your fox sound. <laughs> Good. And Matt gets the foxes. <laughs> oh, all right. So far, so good. So after we each have three factions, we shuffle all the cards together and deal eight to ourselves. So I'm going to be rhinos, chameleons, and pandas. You're foxes, croxes, and bunnies. All right. Okay. Oh, my God, now. Whoa, no. Please. Oh, that's so loud and unnecessary. Factions. Come on, man. Tell us how to play the game. Come on. Okay. For, you hurry it up. Shh. You get four strongholds. Choose one amongst your team to start with and put the other three underneath. Sheila, I've decided for us since you know absolutely nothing about how to play. Yeah. These are our starting strongholds. Uh, we've got the Blackstone Vault. We have the Gold Scale Temple Stronghold. We can play three paws to trigger the last words ability of a friendly animal to play on our support area. Your power cards are the way that you play cards out of your hand. That's how many power you have to exhaust in order to play a card. Right now, immediately, you have to discard one of your cards, and we're going to put it in your support pile. I laid down the bone hammer, because it's Saturday night. <laughs> you're going to hammer on your dick? Is that what you're saying? It's Saturday night. <laughs> I'm going to take a card from my hand, just one that I think I probably don't need, mm -hmm. and I'm going to put it face down like this. That's power. That's fire. <laughs> This is gonna be the war zone right here, no man's land. This is where the animals are gonna fight. Now, if I had a card that cost one, I could play it, but I don't. So now we're moving to the upkeep phase. This is where you draw cards, one, two. Now, one card in my hand has to get discarded into my support, and then my turn is done. Now, what is support exactly? Support uh, is used for anything that has a paw cost. Okay. Well, support also comes from the National Endowment for the Humanities and viewers like you. Yeah. <laughs> Do I start by playing a power card? It's a good idea since you can't do anything if you don't. So I will do that. Good work. And then I have a one. Yep. Gold scale archer. Oh, very nice. He has a special ability. His la last words deal one damage to up to two animals. That's something that happens if he's killed. His power is one. His defense is one. So those are his last words. He says, deal one damage to up to two animals. Can I play more animals? Uh, you can't because this is exhausted. 
This guy came in exhausted, by the way. This crocodile archer, he was tired. He's been up all night. To get lucky. Well, I want to attack your citadel. You can't. It's a stronghold, and you can't because you're tired. I'm done. Sheila, it's your turn. What do you what? got there? Oh, I got cards in my hand. I've got a okay. one. No, I got to draw a thing. No, I nope. don't draw. No I put drawing. a thing down. That's right. But I don't want to put down a one because I want to play a one. That's right. Ha! Ah! <laughs> you know, see, play. Sound okay. like a crow. Do I have so, any animals? Yes. Yeah, no. You're good. I'm good. That's You're all good I get to, to go. do. That's all I get to do. To do. Yep. Yeah, I did my turn. <laughs> yeah. Woo! Uh, I have a one that I think is cool for this phase of the game. It is. Uh, I have a one that I think is cool. <laughs> this is my urban gambler. I get to put the top two cards of my deck into my support area. So it's good to have those. You're 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 a good boy. <laughs> Thanks, Dad. <laughs> I don't know what the deal is with my shirts. I don't know why people get so preoccupied with How bright with it is. You're highly saturated. It's just a red shirt. It's more maroon, isn't it? Uh, no, there it looks it's very red. Crimson? On the TVs. Crimson, yeah, that's what it is. Crimson is sick in its head. <laughs> <laughs> We're having a fun time playing Untamed Feral Factions. You can get that on Kickstarter right now. They have a Kickstarter going on. You can contribute. You can get your own copy of the game. And you can have a menagerie of fighting animals in your home. First things oh, first. You fucking with the worst. A sticking pins in your head like a fucking nurse. Wasn't like that one time. I'm playing my second power card, so oh. now I can play things that cost two. Do you understand why that's a big deal? But you can only have a maximum of five power cards. Yeah, you can see, that was nearly a bite. I was yawning. I was trying to hide a yawn. Being too feral. Don't. I'm, I'm sensitive because Courtney always bites me. The Rockhide Berserker. Oh no. And he's exhausted. He is not exhausted. He what? Has surge. Animals with this ability come into play in the ready position and may immediately be used this turn. It's the first battle, everybody. I choose the Urson Gambler. I do one damage to him. No! And that'll be Matt's turn as soon as I discard into my support. You mean Smat's turn. Smat. Smat's turn. Come skipping down the valley. Matt's turn. Come skipping down the valley. Matt's turn. doob a doop skip. I am going to put a power in my power. I'm going to play White Fur Artillery 2. Arrive, deal one damage to an animal or to a stronghold. Okay. Or you can pay two to do both. You spend two out of your support. All right, I'm damaging Rock Hide Express and the Max Blade Vault. So those are both the wrong terms, but I understand what you're saying. So the Gold Scale Archer will shoot an arrow up the ass of the Rock Hide Berserker. He's fine. Is that berserker? Do you know there's a German word that's like berserker house and shout? <laughs> what does that mean? Insane asylum. Oh. Berserker house and sh no, a Berserker house and shout. Yeah, that's it. My Fräulein went into the berserker house and shout. And then she broke out the berserker house and shout and stabbed man in the eye. You could play that. Do you want to play that? Yeah. Or do you want to play this? You That's a better animal. Or do you want to play <laughs> I would like to put this, do I have to put a crickety ass? Yeah, it's sleepy. But it does have an arrival effect. It's the same as, as Matt's dude. Yeah. Do damage to an animal or a stronghold. Or if you pay two out of here, you can do both. Why not just Yeah, fuck it off. all up. Fuck it all, fuck it all up, up as much as possible. So I turn those in. Yeah, get those out of there. Fuck it up, help me fuck it fuck up. Fuck it up. Where am I putting this? Who do you want to damage? Him. If you do one damage to this guy, he's dead. Do that. Where does he go? He actually goes in your support. <clears throat> what? Oh. That's yeah, like so a positive. Like, you can use your animal's corpses to help you. That's <laughs> awesome. You're not done. Ah! You're also doing a damage to their stronghold. Check it out. Mm. Check it out now. Stronghold wrecker. I need to praise you like I should. 
At first I thought you were starting to sing yakety yak, don't talk back. Take out the paper and the trash. <laughs> and no sun spending cash. <laughs> you got some ointment for that rash. Yakety <laughs> yak. Yakety <laughs> <laughs> yak. Put in crack. <laughs> Pay one to exhaust your animal. You sucking bastard. And then I'm gonna pay one to exhaust this animal. Oh, wow! What the hey, heck? Hey, no! I played the Oromancer. Whenever you use your stronghold ability, deal one damage to a stronghold. Also, his guard. So now if you try to attack our stronghold with any of your animals, this Oromancer's gonna be standing there in your way. Nope. He's not having that shit. Nope. Putting one in my power. I'm playing a three, Rock Hide Defender. He's also a guard. Wallaha. And he's tired, but I got two animals that ain't. The Gold Scale Archer can do one damage to up to two animals. That's if he's killed. So each of these guys can attack him and kill him. That's right, but they're gonna take damage back, don't forget. So these guys are gonna kill him. Gold Scale Archer is going to die, and his last word is triggered, and then I'm gonna do and kill these two. Jeez. So you just killed all of our animals. I did. It's true. <laughs> it was just like an extinction event is what that was. Yeah. Well, now I'm going to play an Oromancer. I'm going to attack your stronghold with these. And on my turn, they have plus one attack, so that's four to your stronghold. That sucks. we got to stop them. Yeah. This is bullshit. I would like to. Oh, no. Oh, I've got nothing to protect us from these guys. You're Sheila. doing a terrible job! Matt, you're a loser. There is brand new Beer and Board Games merch over at our DFTBA store. We have new bottle openers. There's a set of coasters that you can purchase. Cool new merchandise. You want it. Pre-order yours today. You can do it, you old poop. <laughs> <laughs> the Bone Hammer. The bone ammo do two damage to up to two animals each. Funk. <laughs> do you send him love notes? Okay, come on. It's hard when you're sitting next to distractor maximum. Your bone hammer's hard? Ma! <laughs> <laughs> Every time I do something, she's like, blah, blah, blah. <laughs> Matt, I hate to break it to you, but I'm bone hammering your rock hide defender. You can't, you're exhausted. This is an item. Your dude is dead. Dang I don't it. care how enraged he is, he's now toast. He goes in your support pile. So you can, can play an item by itself? Yeah, you got no animals in play. How can you play an item? You said she couldn't do that. She, her item depended on animals' abilities. This does not. I, I, I think you're pulling a fucking snow job okay. here. Okay, hold on. Like a John snow job? You will always be my queen. <laughs> <laughs> Stab. Oh, God, I got a John snow job. That was not a spoiler, everyone. This is may improvised. <laughs> If they haven't seen it by now. <laughs> and I'm also going to kill a shift scale assassin. How? Yeah. Because this does two damage up to two animals each. That Wait, can you go through the guard to get me? I didn't have to go through anything. I used the bone hammer to smack you. You right. said if there's a guard, you have to attack the yes. guard. Yes, if there's an animal. You're just fucking making shit up. Not making shit up. You're cheating. You're a cheat. All it says about items is they have a single use effect and are placed into their owner's stronghold after they are resolved. Okay, well, I'm playing this card, <laughs> and this allows me to kill all of your strongholds and win the game. The shopping list? Yeah, this You're is my special... The shopping list. I'm playing the shopping Re list. Read card. about guard ability. It says in the rule that the shopping list bypasses the guard ability. <laughs> guard does not affect items and animal stronghold card effects. I was just playing the game, right? And you guys can contest yeah. me, and now you've been proven completely wrong and stupid. Fuck your bone hammer. <laughs> I'm bone hammering the shit out of you, my Tiny mother. Dave Matthews, you get out of here. I slit you with my hammer. I see a lot of strategy going on right here in Matt's head right now. Strategy. Strategy. Look at that. The eyes. Different <laughs> options. Each time he moves his eyes left and right, a different option flashes past. Right, left or right. Uh, should I take that card? Or no, I should put that one down for the power. Oh. Yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah, I've made my decision. Yeah, I'm playing a Toothblade Magus. Magus. You have enough to give him Surge, which means if he could attack right to. away. Oh, yeah, I'm going to definitely do that. I, can I kill that Citadel? I can kill that yes, Citadel. Ah, mm -hmm. don't! 
cheese. Bang. All right. Sheila has just played the Tooth Blade Chosen. It's really sexy, kind of. He is kind of sexy. He's got a tight waist and Holy broad shit. shoulders. He looks badass. Yeah, I mean, if he wasn't a crocodile, he'd totally be doable. Big arms. So we're protected a little bit. Ooh. I'm playing Lab Receptionist Deceptionist. <laughs> wow, it really deceived me for a second. <laughs> Pay two to choose an animal with fury on it. This card gains fury equal to that of the chosen animal. There's no card to the Fury. We're very calm over here. I'm going to pay three to trigger our Stronghold ability, which is triggering these last words, which does two damage to your Stronghold. And then whenever a Stronghold ability is used, deal one damage to the Stronghold. You sucker. I was going to do seven damage to your Stronghold before you got that guard up there. Yeah, but, but you can't. can't. Toothblade chosen. Oh, yeah. Right. No, that's right. There you go. Three damage to your guard, which kills him, but also kills the guard. And then I'm going to do two damage to your stronghold. What? Can you? Yeah. Can you? Sail away, sail away, sail away. Sail away, sail away, sail away. Because it's still Saturday, Moan Hammer. Me. You bone hammer. You're both dead now, bone hammer. Wait, he has last words. <laughs> Deal two damage to the stronghold. That stronghold's dead, bitch. No! <laughs> we destroyed two of their strongholds. All four of our strongholds are still intact, so we are the winners. Woo! Bang bong. Did uh, most receptionists have to be a little bit of a deceptionist? Oh, who are you here to see? That's true. Oh, I'm sorry. He's very busy right now. Uh, Allow me to play your little tune on my keyboard. <laughs> <laughs> sail away, sail away, sail away. Ha, ha, ha.